Caribbean Buzz TV from New York to Trinidad and Tobago. And folks, the Bacchanal is done and dusted. Trinidad and Tobago Carnival 2017 has come to an end. And we're going to recap those historic moments from the artist's point of view, starting with soccer sensation, Jidel. And just take control of the bam bam And take control of the bam bam And take control of the bam bam So give me the challenge boy And take control of the bam bam And take control of the bam bam And take control of the bam bam So give me the challenge boy Hey, I wanna say that you're whining Terrific, don't wanna tidy and make it Specific, like on a hard drive boy Just back it, how are you back it? How are you back it? I wanna show my skills How are you combat it? I'm not gonna put you alone In a bracket, put on a tap like so Jadel, uh, 2016, let's start back uh, to last year, you won the Soka Breakout Artist of the Year. How was that experience and how has that journey been since then? Well, it was a very glorious, overwhelming experience, you know, winning Breakout Artist for Soka Monarch, which a lot of people was, um, you know, taking part in and I got a lot of votes and it was like a AK people's choice, breakout artist for new people's choice. So um, it wasn't a judging, exp a judging um, process, it was a um, voting. You know, everybody could have checked the votes online and with my competitor, Salty, um, much love to him. I was very, um, it's a pleasure to be in competition with somebody with such a big, huge song, Rocket, you know. So yes, the journey has been great and it was all about self-development and growth and using the breakout artist as a stepping stone, a platform for me to reach further and to um, progress in 2017. Well, that, that actually is, is my next question because 2016 is out of the way. You've won that now. People are looking to, to, to Jidel to see, I mean, what now? And 2017, you have uh, had a, a really good song that was a steady rotation on radio stations. Um, how has things been for this season in terms of performances, getting gigs and that kind of stuff? Oh, it's really good. I must say that 2017 has been one of my biggest years. I have had um, the song Take Control, Take Control of the Bam Bam, and a power soaker, which I first time ventured into. You know, um, it's called the band, everything to do with masks and carnival and costumes. And um, actually, it turned out pretty well. I can't really complain. You know, it's all about a stepping stone and grow growing. Um, the two songs got steady rotation and I've gotten a lot of gigs. Well, not I won't say a lot, but a good amount, you know, which was some of like the major events in Carnival, which was Battle of Sexes, Ladies Night Out, um, Soka Connect, well I know that was cancelled. I performed in Breakfast I saw it all inclusive. I can't remember all the names of it, but um, it had to re um, refresh my memory. But it was a it was a good bit. Yeah. All right, and um, of course, soccer artists. This is your job. There's no time to rest. You have next year. It's going to be a short season. What is next for Jadel during 2017? Well, everybody says that you know you must not leave out during the course of the year with releasing music and do not wait for carnival to release i mean i'm a love of soca and I, yes i just wait for carnival but i'm going to start very early this year i've been doing audio engineering which is to improve on my craft and development which is with producing mixing and mastering which you hardly see any artists out of trinidad like females especially being involved in that and that's just Basically, my experiences with producers being not lackadaisical, but you know, just late on my projects as the little um, hurdles of a new artist face is like you know, getting his songs late. So, if I was able to do partial um, recording at my home, which I'm having my little studio set up, I would be able to probably progress a little faster. So, I'm hoping for the best in 2018, and I'm going um, to start recording like as Carnival is over. Okay, beautiful. Um, Jidal, I mean, the soccer industry, a lot, a lot of people say that it's, it's a man's industry. Um, females have it uh, a lot harder than, 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 than the male. Um, how has that argument, how is it, how true is it actually? Well, you know, everybody have their um, ups and downs with disadvantages and advantages in this industry as a female artist, new. Um, I guess 
everybody, as I say, have their own experiences. To me, with Calypso Rose, even the way um, Alison Hines in the past have made it through, um, I guess it's, some, it's something called maybe the era, the new era, that make it, make it a little difficult, you know, but I guess you need to be smart in this industry and have your head on, have a manager. You cannot come as a female artist and not having a manager because people, wherever you turn, wherever you go, all parts of the world, there is, you are going to face some um, challenges, especially as a female. Um, you know, it's more male-dominated industry and it's all about, you know, bedrooms. You don't really have much strings to, you know, um, be there. The things that you'll do, a bedroom with lime and stuff with the DJs out and pump and drink. A, females won't, a female won't do that, so you tend to have it a little more difficult with busting through. But as I say, you need to have somebody who's at your corner, a very good manager, to to all the let's say 30 work <laughs> yeah all right and monday and tuesday getting out to the nitty and the gritty now i believe i think you played with legacy how was your experience on the road it was fantastic yes that's what that's the only word i can describe fantastic i can ask for nothing but uh, it was really good i was on the track i was back and forth rooming up and down in the band eating drinking whining gyrating singing yeah Carnival to Banka or you're glad that it's over? I'm not glad that it's over. I was like, I'll need that next day. Come on, like, you know, I start to get a little depressed. And I'm counting down the days already for next year Carnival. And I'm hoping that it'll be much better than 2017 with my music career. Just for the sake of the hundreds of guys that, of course, we will ask seeing this interview. Single, in a relationship, married, or it's complicated? Well, I choose not to answer, but well, the only reason why if I say a single, you will cause me to open a lot of floodgates, you know? And if I say a taken, I don't want to... So the totals. I mean, so, I mean, you're going to open a, a lot of floodgates regardless of your status? Uh-huh. Well, you know what? I rather no floodgates. So I take, I take on. Yeah. <laughs> this is just it like that. If it's floodgates, not for the last well, because. Better not go and cannot handle it. That you just go overboard. Then do it. Then do it. Do it. Then do it. Do it. You better handle it right. Manage it. Hope you don't quit when time to live it. Go 